Since Toyota entered the U.S. automobile market around six decades ago, they have been constantly delivering. The Japanese automaker has been fiercely competing with GM and Ford to deliver reliable, mid-priced cars and pickups. Recently, Ford shocked everyone when they released a compact pickup truck. Everyone underestimated the demand for an affordable and smart pickup truck. Now, however, they're awakening and after Ford, Toyota has responded with its own version of the Ford Maverick. Let's take a look at Toyota's incredible smart pickup truck and see whether it can beat Ford at its own game. Stay tuned! Toyota has always dominated the compact pickup market. They first introduced the Stout, a Japanese pickup to the U.S. market way back in 1965. Four years later, they followed with the Hilux. The Hilux was marketed as an affordable and compact pickup similar to Ford's Maverick. For three decades, Toyota dominated the pickup segment before they went on to introduce a larger-sized pickup called the Tacoma. Toyota is now aiming to compete with the Ford Maverick and the Hyundai Santa Cruz in the compact trick segment with the introduction of an all-new Toyota Stout compact truck. The executive vice president of sales for Toyota North America, Bob Carter, and the group vice president of product planning and strategy, Cooper Erickson, were recently interviewed. The executive stated they're looking at the compact pickup segment and hinted that we could be seeing a new product in the future. Erickson also added the upcoming compact pickup might be more geared for city driving. He said, if there's a customer that needs a rugged, small-body, on-frame vehicle, we can consider that. But if it's more for urban use and less extreme off-road, then it would make more sense to use the TNGA unibody platform. The Stout Target Market The compact cruiser EV concept from Toyota, which might eventually be released as the light cruiser, served as a design inspiration for the digital pictures that have been making rounds on the internet. The illustration gives us an idea of what the Stout pickup truck could look like. The compact cruiser EV is intended to improve the lifestyles of its target market by providing a distinctively engaging go-anywhere all-wheel drive EV experience. Its target market is young professional urban dwellers who have active outdoor leisure hobbies. With a robust body that incorporates various aesthetic cues from the legendary first-generation Toyota Land Cruiser, the car builds on the brand's strong off-road heritage. The squared wheel arches, retro-styled white wheels on the left side, simple powerful body components and other features give it an off-road appearance. So if the Stout is going to be built based on the compact cruiser EV, we expect it to have some of these features apart from the off-road capacity. Since we've mentioned, before Ericsson said that the upcoming compact Toyota truck might be more geared for city driving, it should also get other features like the compact cruiser EV LED lighting elements, an aggressive front fascia complete with chunky side plate, a ladder mounted on the C-pillar, different wheels on the right-hand side, and more. The Stout will also probably have a twin cab design. Depending on the version, we also expect the company's Texas-developed infotainment system to be offered with a variety of touchscreen sizes inside. According to Toyota, the new system has five times as much processing capability as the previous one. We don't know anything about the range and specs of this upcoming compact truck, but it has to at least equal the Maverick specs. The Ford Maverick comes with a 2.5-liter four-cylinder engine with an electric motor for support that produces a combined 191 horsepower as standard across all models. A non-hybrid powertrain is also available with a 250-horsepower turbocharged 2-liter four-cylinder and an 8-speed automatic transmission. All-wheel drive is optional. Also, the Maverick can go from 0 to 60 miles per hour and about 5.9 seconds. If the stud would stand any chance of surpassing the Maverick, it should at least equal these specs. The Maverick can tow up to 4,000 pounds when equipped with the turbocharged four-cylinder engine and the optional towing package. But we expect Toyota to outperform the Maverick here and give the Stout a towing power roughly similar to the Tacoma. The Tacoma can tow up to 6,800 pounds when equipped with rear-wheel drive and 6,500 pounds when equipped with four-wheel drive. Apart from the compact cruiser, another concept of the Stout truck could be based on is the FJ Cruiser. Although we don't know much about what lies beneath the FJ Cruiser's bodywork, we believe it's safe to assume that Toyota's new ETNGA platform, which also serves as the foundation for the Subaru Solterra and BZ4X, will be present. We expect the compact cruiser to have about 250 horsepower and dual-motor all-wheel drive. The more aerodynamic all-wheel drive BZ4X achieves 222 miles of range in its least efficient configuration and is one of the slowest charging EVs on the market. So if that's the case, don't expect it to be a range or charging champion. 
One of the key questions is whether the new Toyota Stout will be an EV or a hybrid vehicle. There is a good chance, though, that it will be a hybrid truck, as hybrid trucks are gaining popularity like the Ford Maverick, which will be the Stout's chief rival along with the Santa Cruz. The Maverick starts selling at $23,000, while the Tacoma starts selling at $28,000. So we expect the Stout to start selling somewhere in between those two prices to provide competition for the Maverick. According to Bob Carter, the next Toyota pickup truck could be available in 2024 or 25. He stated that more information about the upcoming compact truck would probably be made public during Toyota's HQ Confidential in July 2023. Well, that's all for this video. Hope you enjoyed watching this one. Thanks for watching.